Uh, my name is Frances Saunders, and I grew up in Upper Island Cove, a small community between Harbour Grace and Spaniards Bay, and I've been living in Carboneer for 50 years. <laughs> the foods we grew up on were mostly vegetables and homemade, everything was homemade, the breads and cakes and no store-bought. Store-bought and fast foods were practically unheard of. And uh, we were raised on a lot of potatoes, turnip, cabbage, cooked meals, planned meals every day. The household had their menu for the week, sort of. Like Sunday was cooked dinner, and Monday then was leftovers, and Tuesday was pot day, and Wednesday was fish day. Thursday, stew or beans day, and Friday, fish and brews day, and then Saturday, pea soup day. Most of it came from our own gardens, and uh, fish and sometimes came from, fish came sometimes from neighbors and other family members, whatever. But uh, not too much of it was store-bought. Some things we could store by, but uh, the majority of our food came from our gardens, yeah. We used to uh, collect berries. We used to pick berries in the summer a lot, and we picked blueberries and patridge berries. They were preserved in jams for the winter because we didn't have the fridges and deep freezes then like they have today. Do we have dandelion cooked as they cook greens now today? or? Cabbage, we have dandelion, rhubarb, and all that sort of uh, wild plants, yeah. My mom used to pickle cabbage. She'd do pickle cabbage and sell it for 25 cents a head. She used to do a lot of it. It was a way to preserve cabbage. And uh, she'd do berries, patridge berry and blueberry jam and rhubarb jam. and. Rhubarb jam didn't preserve, we found, as well as the blueberry and partridge berry. And they'd put the uh, serto in it to keep it longer, you know. We have jars of that and jars of pickles. And yeah, we kept ourselves going with uh, always had plenty. I remember the baking and things, they'd have to put a lot of wood in the stove, like you know, get the stove going really hot. It was a hot day for baking bread. And they did it all the time. We hardly ever ate store-bought bread. You couldn't get too much of it. And uh, where I came from, they used to call it baker's fog. It's store-bought bread. But we occasionally ate it, but most of it was uh, baked in the wood stove. Everybody had the wood stoves and no electricity then for, you know, baking and stuff. And, same way with the meals prepared on the wood stove. Everything was cooked at home. It wasn't many restaurants, none actually, in my community where I grew up. I'd like to see more of it. I think it's healthier. I think we grew up healthier with uh, our planned meals and our homegrown vegetables and stuff than the food the kids are getting today. Like the Fast food, all the fast foods, there's so much on the go.